Oh man, I'm hungry. Uh, I mean, I haven't, I haven't, I, I haven't eaten in only six hours. I shouldn't be that hungry, but I normally eat like every couple hours, and I haven't because I've spent my afternoon again with the Cox Tech. And I will say this: despite being held hostage in my office while I helped sort out this internet phone installation, uh, the tech was very, very helpful and actually got it done despite being in an old building with old wiring and him having to climb up on roof, on the roof multiple times and uh, us having to uh, do some creative ceiling tile removal and uh, wall drilling and other stuff. But uh, okay, I didn't do any drilling or ceiling tile removal, but I did help pull down the cable from the roof. So I'm a helper. And now we have internet and phone in the office. Uh, I mean, I don't actually have a phone physically in the office because um, I haven't bought one yet for the office. I haven't owned a quote-unquote landline phone in... I mean, basically, I cannot remember. I don't know if I ever have. I don't know if I've ever had a phone that wasn't the same phone slash clock radio slash alarm combo that uh, I used in high school which was years ago. So, um, yeah, it's one of those things like a TV. Oh, come on, son. You're killing me. Not you. It's not saying son like a slang. I mean, the sun behind my head. Oh, see, I tried to do this earlier, but the sun was directly in front of me. And because of that, the shadows from the rearview mirror were right on my face. And that would have only been appropriate if I was singing a Pearl Jam song. You'll, you'll get it in a second. Anyway, uh, oh, there's a Michael Mc, Michael McDonald's play, he's playing at the East Side Cannery. Oh, Michael Mc, I love Michael McDonald. This is the thing. It's a cool thing to love Michael McDonald now. Um, but I have loved Michael McDonald my entire life. I the white in my beard is growing in because of how much I love Michael McDonald. You guys have no idea. You will know once once my master plan is fulfilled. You will know how much I love Michael McDonald. I grew up on the doobies of the Michael McDonald. And 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 it's just like everyone else, no one really liked the Doobie Brothers until Michael McDonald started writing the songs and singing them. Until like he probably started bringing the funk, you know? And uh, yeah, he's got some, some funky blue-eyed soul going on. But everybody's all about Michael McDonald now because, you know, Jimmy Fallon and Justin Timberlake did a little skit about Michael McDonald and had Michael McDonald on the show. You know what? You're posers. You ain't real Michael McDonald fans. No. No. It's me and uh, Orangey. And there's the sun on the other side. Anyway, so yeah. Uh, uh, a phone. I need to get one of those. And uh, then get our wireless set up and whatever. So we've at least got some sort of technology in the office. Still no furniture. Not unless you count the laptop and desk that I have in there. And uh the folding chair I brought from my backyard. Uh, but we'll be moving into the office now, uh, slowly over the next two weeks. Uh, coincidentally, at the same time, I'm going to be slowly moving out of my house. Because we sold our house. Why did we sell our house? Man, we're asking ourselves that same damn question. Uh, but the fact is, uh, someone's given us money for it, and it's more than what we pay for it, and in this day and age, that is a win, right? Yeah! Alright. I think I need to aim the other way. Yeah! Alright. I hope you high-five. I want, I want to see the picture of you high-fiving on your screen, whatever you're watching this on. Anyway, you also notice I got a haircut. Fine people over at Globe Salon. Got rid of all my hair. It looked like crap, guys, and it doesn't look like crap anymore, and uh, uh, that's all I gotta say. So, yeah, thanks for checking out the video blog today. This was, this is, this is a special shout out to Ginger, not that Ginger, but the other Ginger, for watching this. I hope you're enjoying it during your uh, late night shift. Uh, the beard's still here, uh, but the hair is not, and I'm sorry. I couldn't deal with it anymore. I ain't got, I ain't got time for all that bulletness. Anyway, I'm gonna get, get off. No, literally, I'm gonna get off the freeway in a second here. Alright, bye!